here at the Pittsburgh Home and Garden Show. We just finished another antique appraisal event, and I met Michael, and he brought this, which of course is the RMS Queen Mary in the original box. Tell me how you got it. I got it from my uncle who was ship's doctor on the Queen Mary. Ship's doctor on the Queen Mary. Yes. And what's cool about this is you can see actually each of the decks. So the model actually shows you deck by deck of the Queen Mary. I mean, this thing is excellent. Yeah. Isn't this great? So this particular piece dates obviously early on to the 20th century. Then you can put it back. You've got to be careful as you do this. And then it has the original box. Value on it? 250 bucks. Great. Nice, right? It's in gorgeous condition. You want to keep it in good shape. You want to make sure that you don't put any kind of cellophane or other tapes on the box either. I'm going to put it right back in. Of course, the piece, in fact, is has a patent applied for date in the early years of the 20th century, and in we go. Provenance is important too, Michael, because it's still in your family, and the ship doctor was a relative of yours. Yes. Thank, Thank you, you, my friend. Thank you. All right. Come on in here, Russ. How's it going? Good. Good. You and your wife, Pat, of 35 years, came to the program tonight, right? That's correct. We had a good time. All right, tell me about this lithograph tin car. That's a, um, a gift from my great-grandmother to my great-grandfather. Fun. That's nice, huh? Lithograph tin, it's hand-colored, and it has the figures in it still intact. Has a little bit of wind-up on the bottom. When you wind it, of course, runs. And value on your piece? Remember? 750 bucks. Nice, nice. Remember that lithograph tin toys and other tin toys, very emotional market. Sometimes you'll pay too much for them, but this one sells on the retail market today, 750. There you go. Thank you. Hey, Ed, how you doing? Hi. How's it going? Ed Hi. likes Lincoln. I love Lincoln. <laughs> you love Lincoln. Who doesn't love Lincoln, <laughs> right? This is a nice piece, patinated composition matter. This particular piece is a maquette or a small scale model, of course, after the famous Lincoln Memorial. How did you acquire it? Uh, it is state sale. Oh, that's nice. Did you pay a lot for it? I paid twenty dollars for it. On the back, it indicates that there is, of course, the artist named French on the back, and it also tells you a little bit about, in fact, where the piece was molded or the foundry that it was made in. And this particular piece has a secondary market value for your twenty bucks. You got a piece worth fourteen hundred. Great. Really nice Thank piece you. of Americana. Dr. Lori from the Pittsburgh Home and Garden Show with our antique appraisal tour. That was Ed and Russ and Michael. Back to you.